All right, welcome into Brunum in Battle Christmas 2022. This is my gift to my brothers for Christmas. It's obviously a ripoff of a popular internet trivia show that uh, we we love watching all the time. We watch it every, when it when it comes out. So we wanted to do our own. So the two teams playing tonight are my brothers. Team one's Tyler and Carrie. Team two's Blake and Rosie. Y'all have anything you want to say? Any trash? Any trash talk? Ready to win. There we go. Let's do it. All right. Well, let's get straight in. Got the rules here. Twelve rounds of trivia. Round seven, a little different, is our best five showdown round. It's in its own round. Thirty-five seconds per question to answer. Wrong answer gives the opposing team a chance to steal the point or points if it's a doubled round. You got four lifelines, one extra from the show. It's phone a friend. Uh, you can double up one of the rounds. Double shot means you get to answer a question twice. And our extra lifeline is ask mom and dad. Got to double before the round starts. And our version has two niche rounds, both worth double points. Can't use a lifeline during this. So we had the guys choose a sports niche and the girls got to choose anything they wanted. Again, no, nothing to say. Get straight into it. All right, let's go. Round one is NBA for Tyler and Carey. Name this Western Conference active player based on his career achievements. Sixth overall pick who has only played for one franchise. Six time all NBA, top 10 in career three points made and one conference final appearance being the farthest he went. I know nothing <laughs> of NBA. All you. Western, Western Conference. Uh, how much time do I have? 13 seconds. Uh, Damian Lillard, final answer. So, one point right there. Damian Lillard. No, I wouldn't have got that. <laughs> That's a good one. All right, NBA, question two, Blake and Rosie. Name this Eastern Conference active player based on his career achievements. A third overall pick, seven-time All-NBA, top ten in career three-point made, and one finals appearance. James Harden, final answer. Ooh, got it. One and one. Nice. I wasn't sure, sure about third overall pick. That was the one thing I was a little nervous about. Yep. yep. Uh, That's like a double court. Court. Oh, yeah, round two. So celeb mashup. So this is going to be Tyler and Carrie's double. Uh, okay, so here we go. Name the two celebrities based on this picture. That's Ash and uh, what's that girl from uh, uh, Julie, Julia, and... Uh, <laughs> and she ended ADS. Mm. Yeah. That looks right. She's from She's not from Yeah. Yeah. I think it is. Yeah, I think that looks I think it is. Amy Adams and Dak Shepard. Final answer. Final answer. Girl from Wedding Crashers. The opposite. Yeah. Yeah. Oh. What's her name? That's it. That's it. Get there. Get there. Um. Oh, is LaFisher Fisher and Dak Shepard final answer? <laughs> <laughs> They're doppelgangers. That was hard. They're doppelgangers. Hey, the girl outsides are hard. That was hard. That was hard. That was hard. That was hard. They're doppelgangers. But yes, Wedding Crashers is what she's from. Yes. Yes. Yeah, it is Isla Fisher, so. That's a steal on the two points. Question two, name the two celebrities based on this picture. So that's, so that's Rob Riggle, and I can't tell who the middle is. Um, all, right, all right, we're going to phone a friend. So we're going to FaceTime, I guess. Yeah, 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 and you can just walk up and show so they can see it. We're, 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 we're FaceTime Trey, who told us he can't, can't miss on this, which, which means he'll probably miss Okay, perfect. Uh, <laughs> Blake's friend, Trey. Don't do this. Oh, no. <laughs> He's been prepped. Uh, yes. Get the phone to Trey. We need you to get the phone to Trey. Trey. Yes, 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 she's right here. Right here. <laughs> I'm really nervous. Hey, Trey. 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 Hey, Trey.
Just, just, just tell us who the two people match together are. are. That's the question, please. I do too. Ten seconds. Ten seconds. You have to hang up on it. Ten seconds, What? I know. Am I too shaky? Can you five seconds? Four. Anything? No, that's it. Okay. Okay. Bye. We still have time to look at it. Right. So you have 24 seconds still. Is that that little dancing that starts with Julie, 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 Trying to see the inside only. Jojo? I have no idea. Your guess is good. What's the guy's name? It's Rob Riggle. Six seconds. Who is the girl? Okay, five. Four. Rob Riggle and Jojo, final answer. I'm going to have to go look at I, 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 I it. So 35 seconds. <laughs> yeah. Uh, what do you think? I, don't, I, I think he was going to make you win. I feel great because we stole it. 15, 15 seconds. Two. Rob Riggle and Julianne. No. It is Rob Riggle and Elisha Cuthbert. Yeah, she's on a lot of other. She's on a lot of other stuff. I don't. I didn't look it up, but she's on a show that Cassie watches now. It is three one Blake and Rosie. Okay, round three is baseball. Oh, we're gonna we're gonna double. Okay, so the way this is gonna work is you're going to name. This baseball player based on their baseball reference page. Hell yeah. This one is Tyler and Carrie. You may have to walk up on this also. So name this player based on his baseball reference page. I've got it. Yeah, I know who it is. That's my stats, man. 15 seconds. You got this, honey. All right, three, two, one. No guess? <laughs> it is Dexter Fowler. Blake gets one. That's one point. That's one point because if you got Yeah, we're in round three. One point. Yes. Okay, baseball. Second question for Blake and Rosie. Name this player based on his baseball reference page. 2009 to 2018. Um, no, that's not it. Okay. Five, four, three, two. Nori Aoki, that's not it. That's not it. You can just do now. Got him back. A stolen double for both teams. Yeah. You both stole each other's doubles. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. It is Blake and Rosie is is they're up four to three. All right. All right. Okay. Round four is son of a movies. Movies. Okay. First question is Tyler and Carrie. Yes. Two thousand two movie. This movie. Set in 2054 is about a special police force who apprehend criminals based on foreknowledge provided by three psychics called precogs. 2002 movie. Set in 2054 is about a special police force who apprehend criminals based on foreknowledge. I don't know. Check off, check off. I don't know. Two thousand two. Not mid black. Ten seconds. Do you have any idea? Don't say it. No. Five seconds. No, no. Two thousand two movie. Just guess. Born identity. Special police force. That's what I'm like. I'm, I'm going to guess Men in Black, but was that, was that 90s? 90s? Yeah. yeah. No, that wasn't 90s. I feel like that was later. Try it. 
I have another guess, but I don't think they would describe it as this. What is it? Uh, Robocop, final answer. Mom and Dad, any guess? I I I don't know the name of one of them. Uh, Minority Report. Uh, that's a good one. Fun fact, my favorite movie. I don't know if I've ever seen that. Ah. Oh, really? Obviously, obviously, I've, I've never seen it. Seen it. Yeah. <laughs> okay, movies. Question two, Blake and Rosie. It's better be early 2000s, too. 2004, 2004 movie. <laughs> a listless and alienated teenager decides to help his new friend win the class presidency in their small Western high school, while he must deal with his bizarre family life back home. Napoleon Dynamite, Dynamite, final answer. Mm. I, I hate that movie, too. <laughs> <laughs> I, 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 I really don't like that movie. Right, is it 5-3? Five, three? It is 5-3. Five, should be 7-1. 5-3. I, I suck. Five, three. Okay, round five is Chain Restaurants. <laughs> okay, here we go. Tyler and Carrie. This Little Caesars limited time pizza introduced in 2014 Features, features a unique, a unique crust, crust with a cheddar, with cheddar cheese sauce, sauce in place of tomato, tomato sauce. Oh. Uh, uh, we have, we have the, the name, name of the item? item? Yeah, I mean, yeah, you could be close, close, you know. Yeah. It's the, it's the, uh, like, like pretzel, pretzel crust pizza. Do I have to be more specific than that? Uh, uh final? final? He can't tell you that. Oh. Yeah. That's it. Yeah, they call it pretzel pizza on the okay. inside. Okay. Or sure if it's like soft pretzel pizza. No, yeah, that's good enough. That's right. right. You get your pretzel. <laughs> and your pizza. <laughs> I'm All right, chain restaurants. Question two. First introduced in 2016, Burger King collabed with a chip brand to make this menu item, accompanied by a remix of a Mark Morrison track as the theme song. Burger King suck. Doritos? Doritos. Doritos did talk. And you're guessing the menu item, not the chip brand, if that wasn't clear. I mean, oh, 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 sure. I haven't been to Burger King since I was 16. I don't think I've been to Burger King since I was 16. Corey, we're going to pass. Oh, you're going to pass? I'm never, I'm never, there's no chance I'm going to get this. I have never been to Burger King. Okay. Uh, what do you think about Cheetos chicken fries? Sure. I don't care. Hot Cheetos chicken fries? Wait, Wait, you can't. Right. Mac and Cheetos. Oh, it's Mac and Cheetos. And it's Return of the Mac is the song. Is it oh. Mac and Cheese? Oh. It's like fried Mac and Cheese bites. Oh, okay. This, okay. this question was actually, this question was almost ruined by Return of the Mac being the Hurdle song not that long ago. Oh, Mark Morrison. Yeah. 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 Okay. Mark Morrison, but yeah. Oh, well. I'm not, I'm not mad that I missed that. We're down one now. Five more. more. Five four. Yeah, five four. Going into two, guys' guys niche. niche. Mm-hmm. Here's so your kind, kind of first, first time hearing what each other's niches are. Tyler, Tyler 2013 to present, present Astros, Astros draft, draft history. history. Jesus. And Blake, <laughs> 2013 to present Spurs, Spurs history, history in general. This round's worth two. Question one. This 2014 16th round pick has hit 251 with 62 homers and 184 RBIs in his five year major league career after being traded in 2017. Five-year major league career after the no. trade in 2017. Does that help you at all? No. Five, Five seconds. One. Fifteen seconds. It's all right. Five. Four. I don't know. Let me let me guess. Yes. Yeah. Ramon Laureano. Who? Ramon Laureano. I forgot about that. Did you draft him? Mm-hmm. Yeah. Dang. I actually, I yeah. Okay. Guys, niche question two. Blake's 2013 to present Spurs history. 
In the 2014-15 season, after winning 11 straight games, the Spurs were sent from a potential second seed to the sixth seed after losing the last game of the season to this team, whose win thrust them into the playoffs as the eighth seed. Fifteen seconds. Denver Nuggets, final answer. Pelicans, final answer. Nice. Nice. I think you're winning. winning. Yeah, you're, you're winning. winning. That's two points. Oh. Yeah. Oh, oh she's, she's her two points. points. Oh, I was like, I don't know. Yeah. yeah. I thought the situation was gettable, but I also thought knowing the eighth seed from that year was a gettable kind of hint. So I tried to give you two hints. Correct. That is why I thought. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Okay, let's go round seven. Round seven is, this is the showdown round. Oh. So everyone needs their pen and paper ready. So who, who one y'all go first? It's a guy, girl, guy, girl, guy. I will say that's fine. It's all right. 15 seconds. First one, Blake versus Tyler. Days since OJ Simpson Bronco police chase. That's such a good question. Oh. oh, are you, are you writing these down? down? I'm thinking. Oh. And you can't help each other on these. You, you just have to guess. guess. How many days oh, since that? Got it. Five, four, oh. three, two, one. I, I, know, I know the exact date, but I was trying to do it. Okay. 700. 700? Seven hundred? That's 7,000. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. yeah. I mean, 700 days. I'm aware. Wait, wait, I'm sorry. 700 days? To, okay. okay. <laughs> the, the actual answer is 10,415. Yeah. Did Tyler get yes. that? But I did write on there. What everybody know? It is July 17, 1994. I know exactly the day that happened. Yeah, it is. I was thinking 20 years ago. Rosie versus Carrie. Yeah. Calories in a dozen original Krispy Kreme donuts. Okay. I sure do. You can't worry about the calories because you eat Krispy Kreme donuts. Baker dozen or... No. Okay. Twelve. Just, just check it. <laughs> yeah, five, four, three, two, one. Carrie, let me see your answer. Fifteen hundred. Fifteen hundred. Twenty thousand? <laughs> yeah. Actual answer two thousand two hundred eighty. Okay. So you're, uh, you're like two fifty or something. No, yeah, two hundred. Another <laughs> zero. All right. Tyler versus Blake. This is for the win for Tyler. Career RBIs for Javi Baez. Short side. I thought about oh, doing okay. a picture though. Five, four, three, two, one. Nine hundred. Nine hundred. I said five hundred and nine hundred. Actual answer: five thirty-two. Nice. Wow. So that is the win for Tyler Carey. Well, we're gonna go ahead and do the other ones. Okay, let's do the other. I wrote them up. We're gonna do it. Okay. Might as well. Carey yep. versus Rosie. Combined age of Jason Bateman, Jason Sudeikis, and Jason Siegel. That's a good one. The Jason. That's a good one. <laughs> I was trying to guess years and yeah. Five, four, three, two, one. Let me see your answer. One forty-eight. I said one hundred three. One hundred three. Uh, actual answer, 142. And last one, Blake versus Tyler. Career three-pointers attempted for Tim Duncan. Wow. Attempted. Ever. Yeah, attempts, not made. Playoffs or not? No playoffs. Ever? Ever? They both only wrote down two answers, which is not enough, just to, just to say it. Blake, 69. 69. Nice. 21. 21. Actual answer, 168. Oh, I would have never guessed. That's so many. Yeah. I almost said that. Yeah. I was thinking about it. Yeah, I was thinking about it. All right, round eight. Music. 
up, 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 up. What's, What's the score? For Tyler and Carrie. By the way, Lifeline's still on the board. I think you've both only used the double. That's a good point. And you use phone a friend. You're right. Okay. You have Ask Mom and Dad and two guesses. Okay. Guess the title of this 2015 track. This is exactly what I was fearing was title. A better artist, right? Yeah. What's their big song? Right. Play it three more times if you want. Yeah, play it again. I'm getting blurry face and I care what you think. Yeah. Uh, do you have any idea? Yeah. No. 21 pilots? No. Um, I just think if you sing it out loud, you'll know. I don't think it's not like that. I'm going to go with Ride and Find a Sensor. Stress it out. Behave. Stress it out. 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 Stress it uh, Kings, Kings of Leon. Kings of Leon. Yeah. Kings of Leon. Okay. I'm excited for the niches. Girls niches. This one's oh also God. worth two points. <laughs> <laughs> up, up first, we got Real Housewives of New York. All right. And I have no clue. If this is good, we'll good right. or hard. In season nine, episode, episode two, which, which cast, cast member said, said the mugshot mug was, was so embarrassing. embarrassing. My eyebrows looked crazy, crazy, but I but did I at did least have my lashes. lashes. Tinsley Mortimer. And Rosie's the Spanish language. In its female gender, the word la rodilla means knee, but its male gendered el rodillo means what? You got this, you got time. I don't think it's the body part. Yeah, probably not. Yeah. Think about it. There's like, there's like a restaurant named. Oh. I don't know. Um, Chicken? No. <laughs> well, I'm thinking restaurant. What could it be like food wise? Five. The thigh? Three. Shoulder. 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 I was going to think like some of the others. We'll go with that with our final answer. Saying that restaurants are named after it makes sense, it's a rolling pin or roller. There's no chance. <laughs> I know, I don't know. It took me a long time to write that one. I almost made her back out of the Spanish language because I couldn't write a question for it. Yeah, which one was harder? Spanish language or real language? Or real language? <laughs> Yours is something I can Google. Okay, round 10. Okay, wait, so it's. What do you can you give me a score update? It's 10 7. So we're already. Yeah. 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 I think it's 10 7. It is. Yeah. Yeah. How many rounds? Three, 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 left. three left. Three left. We have six points remaining. Okay, round 10. We're going into geography. Six points. Six points remain. Okay. Yeah. okay. Still have three lifelines. Okay. Y'all got two lifelines left. Okay. This one's for this Tyler for and Kay. Yes. Geography. Yes. Geography. No. No. Two states in the central time zone have two cities starting with the letter D with over 110,000 populations. Texas and this state. Oh, Michigan, Detroit. Okay. Okay. Pretty sure that's central. Yeah. Yeah. Denver Mountain. So, I, so I, I think Detroit. I think Detroit. Detroit. Sure. Let me, let's think through it. 20, 20 seconds. seconds. You have to. I don't know. Um, I don't know. Colby Rasmus. God damn. <laughs> <laughs> 
I actually thought Colby uh, Rasmus was too much of a layup for you. The other one was uh, easy right out. Okay. Uh, you, you want to just ask? Mom? You mean ask mom and dad? Yeah. Okay. Each state have two, is the question, by the way. Eastern or Central? Can you, can you think of any other states? Each state has two? Two cities. I have Dallas and one. Oh, well, well, I cannot think of any other cities in the Central. I cannot think of any other cities. Okay. Okay. All right, we're going to go to Michigan. Okay. It is Michigan. Right, right. Cool, cool. What are the other two cities? Detroit and Dearborn. It had to be two. It's two per state. I was hoping you might. Well, I. So Dallas, I didn't what's the other city in Michigan? I didn't. I, didn't. Uh, I don't remember right now. Oh, could be, could Denton. be Denton, even. Yeah, yeah. Uh, Texas has like 50 cities with over 100,000 yeah. population. Yeah, so. so start with D's? No, 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 not all the start with D, but like there's a lot. Good day. <laughs> he did. I know. Uh, okay, right. number, uh, question two, Blake and Rosie, geography. geography. This, this Eastern, Eastern time zone state, state has three cities with the starting with the letter C with populations over two hundred thousand. Is it Ohio? Cleveland. Cleveland. It's gotta be Ohio. Is there another C? Cleveland, Cincinnati, and there's got to be a third one. I, don't know. I can't think of any other. Wait, let's think really fast. Any other? Oh, 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 we got. I think we got. It's, it's Ohio. Are you sure? Ohio. Ohio final answer. <laughs> Deke? We're trying to deke? <laughs> oh, oh, that's right. I don't even need a third one. I call it confident. I'm just trying to deke. I'm scared. That's what made me so Four points remaining. Okay. Three point lead yeah. for Tyler and Carrie. Round 11. We can get this. We If you get this, it's Dormy. No, if you get this, you win. You're correct. You're correct. What is round 11? Salty oh, snacks. No. <laughs> we would like to do that. <laughs> For Tyler and Carrie. Okay. This chip, chip brand was founded, founded during, during the Great, Great Depression, Depression in San Antonio, San Antonio Texas, Texas, Texas and comes in varieties such as Flavor Twists, Twists Flamin' Hot, and Scoops. Fritos. Is that it? Fritos. Scoops is named all Fritos. No. Fritos are normally like strips. Oh. Fritos. Fritos. Final answer. Okay. Final? Wow. That's it. It's so easy. I didn't know it was a bad Yeah. I knew it was a twist. I knew it was a twist. Yeah. 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 No, they have the, the little wavy ones. Yeah. 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 This chip brand, introduced in 1991, known for its rippled texture, comes in varieties such as Harvest Cheddar, Farmhouse Ranch, and a 2007 limited edition Cinnamon Crunch. And you assume Ruffles. Yeah. Ruffles, final answer. I don't care enough to wait. Doesn't matter. Rippled texture comes in variety Harvest Cheddar, Farmhouse Ranch. What other? That's on me, Colby Rasmus. Shit. Yeah. I know. Oh, I just, we both did the same. Yeah. Really? Yeah. I, thought I, I thought I had time to do that. I did not. Um. Where is Cheddar? It's so much fun. I don't know. Yeah, I don't know. Sun chips, <laughs> final answer. Yep. Oh. Sun chips. I knew it was one of the two. Wow. That's all right. Mm -hmm. okay. I kind of had a cheddar. Yeah. Yep. I knew it was I about the cinnamon there. <laughs> 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 yeah. 2007. Long time ago. Yeah. Salsa Ranch. I didn't give Salsa Ranch away. That was too easy. Salsa Verde. No. No. Salsa. Garden Salsa. That's what it is. Okay. Round 12 is brand logos. You're gonna have to guess three logos. So this is Tyler and Carrie. Oh, no, no, we talked about it yesterday. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Mitsubishi, um, that's North, North Face, and the, and the other one is, uh, is like Del Monte. I know it. Uh, or, or I can say them all by the way. Uh, we're going to double dip. Okay, going to uh, use the double dip. Double dip. You've already won, you understand that, right? Uh, 
like the yeah they got um, they, they said what's the, what's the question the ones that are in the refrigerator section the uh, washer yeah yeah okay okay first answer washer washer it's also randy don't you say anything okay. yeah because he gets a chance to steal so and i know it you doubled it while you were winning. I, I, so so to... Yeah, fair, fair move. <laughs> That's okay. All right, brand logos. Question two, last question right here. Name these three brands based on their logos. Polaroid, that's Vans, and that's Gold Bond, final answer. Say again. Polaroid, Vans, Gold Bond. <laughs> it was wrong. It was wrong. Wrong. Okay, okay. Oh, wait, wait. That's it. No. <laughs> I had a tr I had trouble getting six logos. I'm not gonna lie. So okay, what's the final score? We won by two. Yeah, two. Nine to thirteen. Four. Yeah. How did that happen? Uh, yeah, some lifelines go unused. Uh, thirteen to nine, not bad. You know what? High scoring. High score. Coley Rasmus. Coley Rasmus was not the difference. Actually, it was because it was the steal. It's no, no. It would have. Yeah. That's the game. It would have been 11-11. So, so, so. Yeah. Hey. Well, you know what? We had a high scoring and close game. It wasn't over till the 11th round. So that's really all you can really all you can ask for. That was fun. Congrats, Tyler and Carrie. Thanks. Thanks. You did it right on We are the winners. <laughs> uh, we will be uh, reigning winners. Yep, yep. Reigning winners. All right. That's true. We're going to have to have a trophy in the future. Yeah. All right, well, we'll see you next year.